Imagine that you want to collect the information from this news page. So first of all, we can see the title. After the title, we have some information about the person who wrote the article, the publication date, and so on. And here comes the whole body of the document. So when you're using libraries like Beautiful Soap, you might be familiar with the HTML structure of the page, which sometimes can be um, very complicated. So there is a new library out there called Newspaper 3K. Newspaper With Newspaper 3K, you can collect all this information very easily. So how does it work? First of all, you have to install the model with pip install on pip install Newspaper 3K. So after installing the library, you have to import the article class from newspaper. So from newspaper, import article. And after that, since this is the page we are interested in collecting the information, so what we have to do now is to get the URL. This is the first step. So let's create a variable called article article URL article URL which is going to be the URL we have here okay and once we have this article URL then we instantiate a new article so this is CNN this is CNN website so CNN article let's see CNN article equals article of this article URL. Okay, so then we have this variable. Let's see article, CNN article, let's collect. First of all, download it. I have to download the article. After downloading article, we can access all this information that I have showed you before um the text the textual information the information about the writer and the publication date um before getting down road let's see that we want to get the html 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 okay so from this html page honestly this is not a <laughs> human readable because we have a bunch of bunch of information so to get rid of this what we have to do to get a clean data set is to parse the article so instead of showing the html then simply parse it and after parsing the article now we can collect information such as the person who wrote the article who is the author of the article. So the author here is Olivier Darcy. And from the page, we can see that it has been written by Olivier Darcy. Okay. And some other valuable information that we are interested in is um, our, let's say, the publication date. For CNN article, published date. So we can get that from published date. And from published date, this is November 17th, 2022. And we have exact same information here, November 17, 2022. Now comes also about getting the title of the article. So CNN article dot title. Get the title of the article. The title is Inside Twitter as Mass Exodus. And this is exactly what we have here as well. Inside Twitter as Mass Exodus of Stafford's Throne Platform's Future into Uncertainty. Okay. Then get the text, the body of the text, like of the documents. To get the body of the documents, let's there is an attribute called text. So get the text, CNN text, then to have it in easy formatory, let's just print that. Then we have the textual information. 
Okay. Okay, this is New York CNN death inside. Death in the air on Twitter. We have the same information here. And that's it. That's exactly in how easy it is to scrap the content of a web page using this library. There is, you know, you might also be interested in, you know, when you are applying natural language processing tasks, sometimes you might be interested in getting the keywords from a given document. This is something that we can also do using this library. But first of all, what we have to do is to run the NLP um, feature. So article, news article dot NLP. So after running this NLP um, module, we'll be able to perform additional NLP tasks. So what is going to say here? Look up error. Okay since the NLP task is built on top of NLTK when we need to import NLTK and also download the punct module punct? I don't know if how <laughs> this is how we pronounce it but okay NLTK download punct and from there we can use the NLP module and right after that, we can get the keywords from the keywords. So keywords, we have media mask, work, executive, staffers, platforms, mask, employees, and so on, future. And sometimes also you don't want to read the whole article, but only interested in having the summary of the article. So we can do that as well using the summary function summary so we use a summary function to oops da, 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 da. CNN article that summary oh no it's not a function it's an attribute instead okay then in less than <laughs> five minutes i will say we were able to perform all these tasks. If we ha we had to do that with, you know, like I said before, libraries like Beautiful Soap, it will take a lot of time. So that's it. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and see you next time for anyone. Bye bye.